everyone and welcome back to my channel for a new video dedicated to the world of aviation. The movie series Airport consists of American disaster films produced between 1970 and 1980, and based on the 1968 novel Airport by Arthur Haley. Real planes were used in all movies, a Boeing 707 in Airport 70, a Boeing 747 and a Beechcraft Baron in Airport 75, another Boeing 747 in Airport 77 and a Concorde in Airport 79. However, only two of the five starring aircraft have completed their careers. In Airport 70 the star was a Boeing 707 with code number M324F, leased from Flying Tiger Line. In the movie it showed an LL cheat line on its bare metal coating, while the name and the tail belonged to the fictional Trans Global Airlines. Throughout the years, the aircraft was bought and leased by different airlines like Aer Lingus, Qantas Airways, and British Caledonian Airways. In 1986 the Boeing 707 was sold to Omega Air and leased next year to Transbrazil with the code numer PT, DCS. Two years later, on 21 May 1989, the airplane crashed during its approach onto Sao Paulo while it was in service as a cargo. The aircraft was making a high-speed approach to Guarulhos Airport as the runway was set to be closed in a few minutes for maintenance. During the approach, one of the crew members activated the air brakes and the aircraft lost airspeed and ended up stalling. The plane crashed into a heavily populated slum in Guarulhos, two kilometers from the runway. All three crew members lost their lives, as well as 22 people on the ground. Five months later, another aircraft starring in the airport saga was involved in an accident under very disturbing circumstances. In the plot of Airport 75, a Boeing 747 suffered a mid-air collision with a Beechcraft of 55 Baron. In the movie they used a Boeing 747 of American Airlines, with code number N9675, and a private Beechcraft airplane with code number N9750Y. While the Boeing continued its freighter service until the end of its career, the Beechcraft Baron had a more tragic and disturbing fate. On 24 August, 1989, the airplane suffered a mid-air collision with a Cessna 180 in California, which was a very similar accident to the one that had been simulated in the movie 14 years earlier. Airport 79 was produced in 1979, it's the last one of the four American air disaster movies, whose protagonist is a Concorde. The Concorde aircraft used in the film was registered as FWTSC by the Aerospatiale Aircraft Company, and then it would be re-registered as FBTSC and leased to Air France in 1976. On 25 July 2000, the Concorde, identified as Air France Flight 4590, was hit by runway debris during a takeoff. The debris blew up one of the Concorde's tires, which punctured a tank under the fuselage on the left side of the plane. The flames immediately flared up, and not long after the engines one and two of the left wing were out of order. There was no point in hoping to save the plane. 121 seconds later the plane crashed onto the small French town of Gonesse, in the west of the Charles de Gaulle airport. All the crew and the passengers on board lost their lives, as well as four people on the ground. 